Good, happy on Thursday morning. I'm trying to get out of here. I woke up really sick this morning. I think between the heat and the way I'm pushing it, it did me and I still don't feel well. But I'm going to try to get some stuff done today. Okay, I have the song of the day. I have the trivia. I just walked down the hall for some reason and started singing it. I thought, perfect. I have the camera in my hand. This will be music trivia for today. If anyone should ever write my life story. I'm <coughs> sorry. You guys know I'm not a singer, so I can't sing every tune, every note. And sometimes I don't even know the words. So as long as we know that. But, and for those of you that are playing, I actually might do this as a contest. So there might be a surprise at the end of the month. Everybody that's entering and that gets it right, I'm going to put your name into a drawing. And July 31st at, well, after, after the vlog comes out on July 31st, on August 1, I will announce the winner. So let's try again. <clears throat> if anyone should ever write my life story. A little better. Comment below, artist, title, and I'm going to enter you in a contest. And I'm going to go back from the very first song that I sang and how I have to do it because here's the deal. If six people comment and get it right, that's kind of unfair because they may have copied what the person ahead of them wrote. So the very first person that comments with the correct song and title each day, that's the name I'm going to put into the drawing. I hope that's right. I don't, I don't do contests because I never could. So um, I think I've done two contests on YouTube, I think. So this will be my third. And I'm not sure yet if I'm going to share what I'm going to give as the prize because I don't know if it'll change. So I'm not going to share it yet. But if you're interested in entering the contest, put the name of the artist and the title of the song below. Be the first one that comments with the correct answer. Your name will go into the drawing. And I'm burning up too much energy trying to be excited about it. Guys, it's hot. I think I need to stop playing around with this heat. I got out of my car and I got out of my car and walked to my leasing office which was a total of about 30 steps maybe and I got in there and I could barely talk like that's how bad this heat is affecting me so I am actually headed somewhere if I can't find a parking spot it'll be a wasted trip um, if I can't find a close parking spot it's gonna be a wasted trip because I'm not walking in this heat. This, this is it for me. I'm not coming back out in heat like this. I woke up so sick this morning. I don't even know if I told you guys. And I knew it was from pushing too hard and the heat. And um, then I couldn't sleep last night. It was just horrible. So I slept till about noon. Today's the last day I'm coming out in heat like this. <laughs> There's my ex. <laughs> One of my exes. <laughs> I never see him hardly. I thought that was him. And, um, yeah, <laughs> I saw his bald head. So anyways, um, I'm so glad we don't run into one another. It just makes life that much better. You know, it's horrible when a person says that they love you and, and then they cheat on you and they don't see anything wrong with it and then they, mistreat you it's just horrible now when I just say stuff like that please don't think that I was perfect little miss perfect please don't but I'm always willing to change I'm always willing to work on me whereas the people that I've been with in my life that I've dealt with in a relationship level are not willing to put in the work I need to be paying attention I guess I thought I knew where I was going I forgot I had the GPS on I think I came the wrong way 
Okay, I have no clue where my GPS has taken me. I just know that I'm further away than I was before. Okay, I'm trying to get way over there. I don't know why my GPS brought me here. I think I might know where I'm at. Whoops, I think that was my turn. That was my turn. See, now I'm lost again. I can't believe I found it. I was right in front of the building and missed a turn. And it's a mess. There's construction always everywhere. That's probably what throws the GPS's off. I'm just so tired. Oh, my poor eyebrows. One of my great nieces had some Kat Von D. But one of my great nieces had a friend. They were in a video on Facebook using some Kat Von D. Eye pencil. Can I go this way? Car did. Even if I went the right way. Okay. Nope. I followed that car. Use like, any lane to guys. Let me stop talking. Okay, guys, I'm leaving, and I'm thinking of. Um, I mean, I'm looking for places. It smells so good down here. I need to get something to eat. So, guys. Um, oh, hello. So, I just got out of work. I am just. Have my Checking out downtown, and some of the people are so nice. They've really been helping me along the way. So this is, I'm looking for a place to celebrate this year, and so it's nice enough for me to be out. And unless I'm in the sun, then it gets too hot. Woo, guys, I am glad my car didn't get a ticket, but that I did not get towed. Look, there's the meter lady. My time had expired. I would stop and eat, but I'm getting pains in my head. And I'm just too worried that this heat is too much for me. Okay, guys, I'm in. Some guy, some guy was so nice. He, um, today's been a good day. I've had some good news. Met some nice people. But, uh, whoops, let me take my hat off. Yeah, so, today's been a very blessed day. And, uh. But you know what? The past few weeks have been really unusually kind to me. And I shouldn't say unusual, unusually. That's just God and his blessings. Oh, wait, I gotta get the air on. It's too hot in here. Okay. So yeah, life has just been really good to me. People have been good to me. I just came home and somebody was parked in the handicap and so I parked in a regular spot and uh, they were coming out and I said, are you parked in the handicap? And he said, do you need me to move? And I said, do you have a handicap sticker? And he said, yeah. And I said, oh, and he said, but I'll move. I'm like, okay. He said, I don't need to park there. He said his aunt broke her leg and she's on crutches. And so that's why he parked there. And I said, well, thank you because what happens is then I park in a regular spot and sometimes you guys know I don't make it out for a day or two. So that means for two days somebody down there is out of a parking space because they can't park in handicap and they can't park in a regular because I'm in it. So that was just so nice. So that was interesting but life has been doing that a lot lately. Anyways it's too hot. It's almost seven o'clock. I haven't ate. I ate one egg and a piece of toast all day because I just don't feel well, but I gotta eat something. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna practice and then eat and then rest. Get the side move. That's the only thing I'm having a problem with on this dance. Everything else I got. Okay, guys, I think I got it. I can even do it to the count. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I got it. I got it. Practice. Practice really does make perfect. It's 7.14. I gotta eat before 8, 9 o'clock. I'm not even hungry. I'm hoping this stirs up an appetite. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. Why is it so blurry? That's too blurry. So anyways, this is my dinner. I'm making a salad. So I've got that little piece of chicken. I was going to have hot dog. So I've got hot dogs cooking too. And I've got some chickpeas I'm warming up. But anyways, I'm going to practice dance one more time while I wait for my chicken to heat up. And then I'm going to eat and then I'm going to go to bed. I need to contact my cousin because I'm sorry I'm always looking around because you know when you make YouTube videos you got to make sure everything in your house is hidden because people ain't right okay salad is completed I put the chicken in I was gonna put some avocado in because my avo's about right it's perfectly right I should but I'm not that hungry and this salad is big enough if I put avo in there's no way I'm gonna be able to eat it but you know what guys, here's a little hack that I learned. Do you ever use rubber gloves to do your dishes or your cleaning? And like the right hand, especially if you're right-handed, the right hand always tears up and gets a hole in it. Then you end up with all these left-handed um, gloves. Well, I learned a nice hack. Turn it inside out. Um, also, another one I saw was, like if you like to save on your water bill. Can you guys see me if I put you up here? If you save on, want to save on your water bill when you flush your toilet, fill up like a pop bottle and put it in the back of the tank. I'm sorry, I'm trying to stand on my toes. Put it in the back of the tank and that way you don't use as much water filling up your tank. It's amazing the things that, that people knew that they kept from us but they're willing to share because they get paid for sharing the info now. Alright guys, I'm going to probably just go ahead and say goodnight. I'm going to eat, do one more dance, and go to bed. Good night, guys. Did I do a song? Did I do a trivia?